These are three movement techs for Dark Tide that you need to know to increase your survivability, giving you the edge to beat harder difficulties. The first tech I call the Slide Dodge. To perform the Slide Dodge, simply initiate a slide and right at the end of your slide, turn your character so you can dodge toward the direction you're sliding. You can use a Slide Dodge to safely cover a fair amount of distance, allowing you to close the gap on enemies with guns. You can turn your character at any point during the slide, but I usually wait till the end of the slide so I can see my target before dodging toward them. The timing of the dodge can be a bit finicky. If you dodge too late, enemies have a chance of shooting you, and if you dodge too early, the dodge won't come out. It's important to consider the weapon you're using, as certain weapons will let you dodge further, so try to get a feel for the distance you can travel with your favorite weapons. You can also dodge into a slide, slightly carrying the momentum from your dodge, and you can slide dodge into another slide, though this only gives you a small amount of extra distance, as you don't carry much momentum from your dodge, but it's still good to know about. Mastering the slide dodge will really help you improve your maneuverability and help you out in those tough situations where you're pinned down. The second tech I call bunny sliding. In this game, you can start a slide immediately after your character starts running, which means you can slide over and over again in very quick succession. To perform a bunny slide, keep your sprint button held down and press the slide button immediately after your character starts running. Repeat this over and over again and you get the bunny slide. It's important to note that you aren't invincible when bunny sliding. That brief moment when you stand up to initiate your sprint, you're vulnerable and enemies are able to shoot you. Using the bunny slide to approach enemies is very situational and will only work when timed properly to avoid bursts of fire. The bunny slide can be used as a safe option to get to cover when you're moving parallel to your enemies. It's not always useful, but it is good to know that you can go into slides very quickly. The last tech that you need to learn is called the ballerina slide. This one is quite simple. You just slide and do a 360. It's important not to spin too fast while sliding or other players won't be able to see that you're actually spinning because your player model won't actually track all of your movement. When you combine that technique with a no scope, your enemies are 100% guaranteed to die. So start ballerina sliding into every special enemy you see. Trust me, your teammates will thank you for it. And that's all I got for you today. Mastering these three movement techs will greatly improve your survivability and help you feel more comfortable moving around the map. As always, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and want to see more. I stream almost daily on my Twitch channel, linked in the description down below, and I will see you next time.